I'll be on some other shit It's kinda bittersweet that I fell in love with it I always felt that if I always cared about how I dress That folks would think I'm arrogant and chicks would lose interest But as it turns out, people start to notice you more You turn heads when you step and foot in them sneaker stores Like where you get them, can I get them, what's the biggest size left And chicks that never would have seen What's up everybody? It's Big Roth TV and I'm back with another sneaker video. Alright? Now, this is one of two final videos here at this current location. If I could show you around right now, you'll see I'm kind of in the corner packing things up, getting things ready. I'll be moving back to the States here in about a month if all goes according to plan but this one right here is one of the final pickups in this location all right so let's go ahead and get into it before i bring the box over you all know big rough proud member of the Braun gang all right now these are the LeBron 17. I don't know what the FP stands for. I don't know. But anyway, white, university red, and black, size 14, of course. And the USD on these, the retail was 225. Woo! 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 I had to eat that at this time. I had to eat all of that. But, the sir, Braun Box, that very familiar Braun Box, you've seen it plenty of times on this particular channel. This right here was a must cop for me. Soon as I saw the first images of these, I said must cop action. I missed it on sneakers. I had to call my brother. I said, yo, hook me up. See if they're available on Foot Locker because I'm not able to shop from Foot Locker in the United States over here. So I had to get my brother to assist me. He did urgently and we were able to make that happen. All right, so let's go ahead and get into the, let's get into these. Of course, of course, you all know how I do it right here on Big Roth TV. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Left shoe first, baby. Ooh. Ooh. Off the top, off the top, from the very beginning, these get the ah! Brett the Hitman heart championship belt kiss of approval because these are just too sweet now before i get into these just look at a little bit of the details of this shoe and you can see that they are very simple man they knocked it out the park they knocked out the similarities this is the the black and red colorway of the LeBron 4. Man, this was, the LeBron 17 was the perfect model to do some, some versions of the 4, some tributes to the 4s. This was the shoe. Look at the details, man. Look at the top. Look from the top down. Man, they knocked it out. To me, it almost looks better on the 17 with the materials and things that they can do on the upper versus, you know, the leather and things on the four. I like the fours, but man, this 17. Let me put the four to the side. Who? Who even down to the laces? Look at the, I'm sorry, I got to bring it back. Look at the laces there on the end. And then look at the laces here. It's the same. They did, man, they knocked it out, man. They knocked it out the park. You got your 2-3 on the middle pool there. 
some that elastic just like over here on the fours got that strap at the top very dope very dope this says 2006 on the inside hope you all are able to see that it has that 2006 here on the tip the same logo that's on the front of the strap is on the front of this one let's see the front Nike on the front of the four is his initials the LRJ on the front of this is that Nike but even on the the back is similar and then the cuts that are there on the sides they did that too here boom 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 man they nailed it they nailed it on this one yo I had I had to have this shoe I had to have it and nice graffiti touches going around the midsole there all along the back man I really want to know what these numbers and letters are I really need to figure that out I'm gonna have to look into that on the bottom red bottoms black LeBron signature there very nice let's see if there's anything you got your Lion King there on the tongue and then we take out the shoe tree take out this paper it's a little tight in there Boom. get that paper out got that big two three on the inside there red insole two three on the back of the tongue it says never forget to hear the voice of the athlete never forget to hear the voice of the athlete you all probably can't see that with the light there but that's what it says on the back of the tongue I don't know if I mentioned it but there is a Nike swoosh there and the upper while the straps are more white and this is more white it's kind of a cream going around the upper this is more of a off-white kind of a creamish color whereas this is white let me pull out the right boy and see if there is a, a difference right shoe second all right, on the right boy, there is actually no differences. They made them the exact same. All right, there's nothing different like here or there. Or same Nike logo there on the front. Just wanted to make sure. Let me just make sure the tongue. Yep, same Lion King on the front. Boom, everything is, everything is the same. Everything is the same, which is no problem. There's no problem, man, no problem. I just wanted to make sure that if there were differences, then I could show you all the differences. But very dope shoe, man. Very dope shoe. Glad that I am able to add it to my LeBron 17 collection. This actually might be the final LeBron 17 that I cop. I was hoping to get the what the LeBron 17, but it appears, at least from my research, it kind of looks like that's a women's only release. I haven't seen it in, in in big sizes, and I haven't even seen an actual release date for it. But from the pictures and things that I've seen online, it looks like it's all women's sizes. So if they're doing a women's only release in that one, then I'm not going to be able to cop that because those usually don't go up to a size 14. So just got to eat the L on that one. Now, let's go ahead and take these boys on feet. All right, so here we are on feet. This is what I was wearing today. Got the got the sparkle juice on here. Got the sparkle juice. I'm gonna have to wipe them down, but today I said the hell with. I just rocked them as is. The black and red Jordan ones from 2016. Very dope. Very dope. Let's get these out of here. All right, and for the on feet today, I wanted to show you the fours and the 17 so you can see a comparison on foot all right now with the fours 
You see how everything is since this shoe, this 17 is based off of this shoe. Just wanted to take a good look at that four. See how it's built. All right, now we go ahead and switch it over here to the 17. Man, they nailed it with the construction. They nailed it. Whoo! They nailed it, man. Get the front. Boom. Get the front. Boom. All right. Everything is fairly the same. Of course, with that new technology. Look at the look at the bottoms. They're coming at ya. That coming at ya. Of course. The 17 is going to sit a little bit higher with the pods and everything on the bottom, all right? So more air as well. They got that 720 air. So these are definitely going to sit higher than the flatter feel of these, all right? So definitely like that. Now as for the sizing, 17s, my toe, big toe is right here, all right? I cannot go down to a 13 I am a true 13 and a half in Nikes so 14 fits fine fits perfectly fine I prefer a 14 in LeBron 17 so my recommendation for you half size up that's my recommendation in these if you want to know if you're out there searching for a LeBron 4 you know what I mean same thing big toe right there Got a little bit of room, a little bit of room, but a 13 would be too tight in these, so half size up. That's that's my recommendation. All right, now let's go ahead and get a little bit of that booty view. Let's go ahead and get a little bit of that booty view for you all. Look at the similarities, man. Ooh knocked it out knocked it out the park yes sir but anyway that's gonna do it on these definitely recommend you go cop these probably probably my favorite lebron 17 man and that's a hard statement to say that's a hard statement to say especially with these sitting over my shoulder right now that's a very hard statement to say and the black and reds and the lake show <sighs> okay I don't know it, it, this is still one of the top LeBron 17's release I do want to make a correction there is a slight difference as you get the right one out on the tongue it does say King it says King here on the right shoe and on the left one it is James all right so King on the right shoe James on the left shoe for King James all right but that's the only difference between the two basically all right but that's gonna do it man thumbs up if you like this video subscribe if you have not already thank you all for watching thank you all for subscribing I truly truly appreciate it more content is on the way and i'll holler at you all in the next video peace